Lucas Media. My bad, y'all. I've been busy with work a lot lately. Um, I'm going to go back to making more content multiple times a day. And uh, at some point, this will be my full-time job. But anyway, let's get to it. So Draymond Green. And I've seen two raw videos. Shout out to him. Make sure y'all subscribe to his platform. But Draymond Green says, I think it's quite, or I think it's actually quite bull. You know what? Now that we got one of our premier faces in this league, the MVP of our league, possibly hurt because he's forcing it. And this is Draymond Green on the NBA, a 65 game rule to get some type of awards. Now, I watch basketball. I'm not a savant like too raw. You know, I'm more of an old school. I remember a lot of them. I mean, I do watch NBA games, but you know, it's just, it's a bad product. I'm sorry, but I gotta I gotta chime in on this. Let's let's make this clear. Draymond Green, y'all sitting here crying about going to work, right? But I did my math. And it says that the average NBA player makes $8.5 million a year. Divide that by 52 is 163, 164,000 a week, give or take. Now, we know you got to pay taxes. Let's say you take away 30, 40%. That's still more than what the, what the average American makes in a year. Families combined. But y'all making that a week, and that's on the average. Let's see how much how much does Draymond Green make a year? Let me take a look. Draymond Green makes twenty five million dollars a year, so he's making triple or three to four times more than one hundred sixty something thousand dollars a week. He basically making a half million dollars a week. A week. And you're going to sit here and complain about having to go to work? When it's Americans that's making $40,000 a year with a family? No. I'm sorry. I don't want to hear this crying. Yes, playing 82 games is taxing on your body. Yes, you're going to get hurt. But so what? You signed up for it. I'm sorry. Swap any of us out. Right. All any anybody who's listening to this, watching this, you gonna play them eighty two games for twenty five million. He on the low end too. Let's see how much. Who's the highest played player right now? Let me see. Uh, let's see. You got Stephen Curry making $51 million a year. Uh, Joker making $47 million. LeBron making $47 million. So, yeah, no, we don't want to see y'all in street clothes. No, we don't. You need to show up at all the games. Michael Jordan was playing, trying to play all the, was playing all the games. And he wasn't making no $51 million. Now, he was making money in endorsements. But that's the problem with these players. Y'all get all this money and y'all start whining. And Jordan... He warned this back in what, 2005? Somewhere around there. He warned about this. Y'all crying. Y'all lazy. I'm sorry. Nobody wants to hear that when you're making that kind of money. I'm sorry. We don't. Because while y'all talking about, oh, it's hard on our bodies, swap us out. You know, I'm at retirement age, at least for the NBA. And I would have my ass out there all 82 games. As long as I can walk, I'm going to be playing. So, no, I'm sorry, man. I don't want to hear this. These whiny, cry NBA players, man, go to work. Most of us can't take off days like that. Could you imagine being a CEO of your company? And you crying because you got to go to work and they paying you 50 something million dollars a year. 25 million a year hell even 5 million a year they gonna work you they gonna work any the average American if they make 180,000 they gonna be working harder than 
than what the NBA player is doing. So, no, we don't want to hear that. Get over it. But let me know what y'all think.